the second half. The other parts who are fully coolie. And you know, not that it's an issue, but I, why are the main characters girls? You know? Oh, and she's got a broken iPhone. Whoa, this one is very particular. It's El Shaco. <laughs> okay, I love this. The monologues are back. Hopefully, that's not the only time we hear monologuing. And, and I like, I love the artsy fartsy stuff. Whoa, she's thick. I don't know who that is. Oh, there she is. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> All right, this is cute so far. Okay, you probably Class two A, really. Okay. Da. So she looks up to people. I think that's the easiest thing. <laughs> Uh, but that's just shallow. They just want things to be easy for them.
Um. Oh no. That's a lot of sauce. <laughs> Whoa. Is that his, I mean, is that her dad? Look at how to go. I don't know what to say. Never knows best? What? Why'd she write that there? Clearly she knows best. She's not a bad girl. She's extremely social. I don't know, maybe it's already written in a brick? <sighs> oh, she lost. Like what that means. <laughs> uh, did I miss something? <laughs> wow. Okay, this is annoying. Okay, cute. I mean, I don't know what to say. Bird watching at this hour. Contemplate, don't you think? 
Oh, like how he said bird watching. What are you doing in this town? Or rather, should I say, this planet? Um. So are you searching for it again? The ammo. Who's that? This. Is this the outro? I'm like, is this the outro? Like, we're not even close to the ending yet. I guess this is the opening? This is very strange for a fully coolie show to have an intro. But hey, this is why this show. It's called Fully Cooly Alternative. Wow. Which, ironically enough, which I don't think it's ironic at all, but this song is extremely alternative. It's pretty soft. Because, you know, I, I kind of like... I like, uh... Whew, whoa! And I, I like the uh, louder side of the pillows. And there's just space ship there. I'm like watching this opening and not really paying attention to it because I don't want any spoilers. Tunnel vision. <laughs> Wait, she has a brother? Uh. <laughs> okay, we'll make this part red. This should be yellow. Oh, they're coloring the rocket. Wow. Girl power! Yay! Jesus. What? <laughs> I'm ready to scream with the, uh, what is this? I oh, like the cat ears. Wow. Throw a throwback to a show that's not even nostalgic. What is this? All, this is. This is. This is the. This does not feel fully coolie. Wow. <laughs> what? 
She was taking pictures of her friend's ass. Wow. What do they call it? The universe? And it so happened to fall out of her house? What? What about the spaceship? It got destroyed? What the hell is that? What? Uh. Oh. Is it gonna make that thing come alive? No. Why is she standing there? Why is she crying? Oh, here comes Haruko. Ah, she just straight up kicks her. Great. <laughs> My bad, is she dead? Whoa. Where's her guitar? Yeah, keep feeling. <laughs> uh? Oh, there's the first horn. That's a flower. Her whole house is about to collapse. Whoa, look at that. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, is she really, or she is pretending to be? I I never really got a true answer to that. Oh, just the way they animated. Oh, up oh, and there's the guitar.
Uh, what I don't understand is why did Hadako come and s try to save Kana? Or why did Kana get attacked? What's the point of all of that? Uh, so much for the rocket. But yeah, her house is destroyed though. So, yeah. Yeah, that's the easy part, but what about the freaking house? Or some something like that. Uh, I mean, Ide. I I don't know. Okay, Who is that guy? Ready? Let's count again. Four, three, two, one. Oh, and then it's destroyed. <laughs> What? <laughs> what is that? Yeah, yeah. Whoa. All right, wow. It's extremely alternative. Yeah, it's very different uh, uh compared to Progressive and the original Fully Cooly. This version uh, feels extremely grounded and definitely more them uh, thematic uh, than progressive and similar in ways to the first Fuli Um We're following a character with much more emotion, much more raw emotion, and those teenage angst, those, uh, s you know, simple childlike behaviors. I like the end of the episode there where, you know, there's that saying, hey, you don't ever know the good times. You only know them when they're gone, you know. And uh, you have this group of girls who, you know, they're just enjoying their childhood. And then years would go by and, and you realize those little moments, you would want them again. And you're never going to get them again. And, and you don't know how hard it is to get it again. And I feel like that could be the metaphor there with them trying to, you know, shoot the rocket and then seeing these other rockets do better than theirs, you know. Uh the unreachable is scary, you know. But then now add onto the already established universe of Haruko and the NO powers and the forehead robot stuff and you get fully coolie. <laughs> now this one's a little bit different compared to the other fully coolies even much more because like I like how they they did this trilogy pretty well in the sense of you know, the original uh, um, Fulukuli was with a middle schooler, with a 12-year-old. Then we jumped into um, Fulukuli Progressive with a girl in uh, as a freshman in high school. And now we're at Alternative with a girl 
uh, at the last year of high school. You know, she's about to be 18. So it's not just the last days of childhood, but yeah, it's, it's becoming an adult, you know, and being an adult is very scary too, you know. So I wonder how thematic that's going to be. If the show is going to use that as well. I like the opening. I like the monologuing. Uh, I like the art style. Very different compared to Progressive. So, um, honestly, the only thing I didn't really like so far about this show is that the music is not really amping me up. Uh, I'm not saying that I need, like, hard rock, hard riffs, you know, but uh, it, it's a little bit soft and mellow. And, and I guess that's the point. You know, it's called alternative, you know. But, um, it's pretty soft <laughs> compared to, compared to what I'm used to with Fully Cooley. So, all right, that about wraps up my video. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.